Okay, so we've got our three layers on our TV. We got the bubble wrap or an old blanket, whatever you have available. Then we have cardboard protecting the screen in the corners. And then we have another layer on the outside of that, either a moving paper pad, a cloth pad, or another old blanket. Now we need to build the big box. A little bit of tape and a big box. Pushing the short edges, pushing the long edges. You're going to want to tape this up more than you would if you were going to put it on, say, a mattress, because we're going to cut this up and we need to maintain its structure through the process. I know, but better safe than sorry. One side's built, flip it over, build the other. big empty box. This is where the razor blade comes in. You want to go ahead and cut the box all the way around through the middle. I would suggest a fresh razor blade. boxes now have. You can actually use it just like this, but I'm going to take it down another step. I'm going to quarter. Because I want this to fit as tightly and snugly on the TV as possible so it can't rattle around in there. To me that provides more protection. big box has become four smaller sections. You want to do what's called telescope the pieces together. See how I've integrated them where they're basically married together. Next step, you would take your moving pads, your paper pads, whatever you have, and 
line the base of the box. I use the paper pads. Tear them up, fluff them up a little, throw them in the box. your base that you're working with, try and get them close to the same aspect. So that TV's going to fit in there real nice. Just a little bit of room on each side, maybe two, three inches. Here's where more the paper pads or old blankets, whatever you got. Play. Also, not everybody's going to be able to get a hold of a pillow top mattress card just cut up in a section like this. Find whatever cardboard you can, and once the TV's in these three layers, you want to wrap it with more cardboard again. And basically, just build a box. Yeah. You want to make sure it's not going to rattle around in there. Okay. So now it doesn't have any shifters back and forth. We're going to use the top. More paper pads, more towels, blankets, sheets, whatever you got. They go into the corners. You want to do this one section at a time. Lock that in there nice and tight, kind of compact. Drop your section on. And you want to put it inside the base. Makes it much easier to work with. I guess newspaper would work as well. You need a lot. snug the box all together. Good snug fit. Back to the tape. See if I can find the edge. 